so when i say a uh, a pendulum watch means simply like a clock is going to make five gongs at 5 o'clock at 10 o'clock 10 gongs are going on now first gong is going to be sharp at 5 o'clock this is going to be the first gong after interval of x second second gong after another x second third gong another x second fourth gong and another x second so simply when i say striking 5 o'clock there are going to be five gongs for second third fourth and fifth but there is x seconds interval between the two gongs so intervals are going to be four so when i say striking 5 o'clock there are going to be four intervals when i say striking 10 o'clock there are going to be nine intervals so the question is about it takes 30 seconds to strike 5 o'clock means the gap between the first interval and the last sorry first gong and the last gong the time difference between them is going to be 30 seconds the first gong and the last gong so in how much time will it strike 10 o'clock so at 10 o'clock between first and the 10th gong there are going to be nine intervals so nine intervals 30 into 9 upon 4 let's quickly check out the concept is when i say gong clock at 5 o'clock there are going to be five gongs first at sharp 5 o'clock after every x second there is going to be inter gong so when i say 5 o'clock there are going to be five gongs and intervals four 5 o'clock four intervals 10 o'clock nine intervals and going on so the word meaning says between first and the last gong four gaps are going to be there for that the watch needs 30 seconds so to strike 10 o'clock nine intervals nine gaps will be of how much time which a very important concept if we are striking 6 o'clock there are going to be five gaps in between the six gongs 